Hey folks, it's your boy Paris, and it's New Bike Reveal Day. Oh. All right, we brought home this 2019 Honda Monkey. Uh, it's been setting since 2019, not running. The previous owner said that he lost all power after riding the bike. Uh, we looked it over. Everything seemed to be in, in good shape, so we took a chance on it. We brought it home. As you can see, he's done all this aftermarket bling stuff you can see it all up here on the handlebars it came with a yoshimura exhaust as well brand new out of the box so again with all the bling on this side you can see it all up in here as well we got a chimera air intake and so he was unable to get the bike going after several attempts of his own and so the first thing we did, because 99.9% .9 of the time when you lose all power to the bike whatsoever, it's typically a ground issue. So uh, how we tested for a ground to make sure it was a ground issue is we took, uh, you can take anything that's, you can take a jumper cable, you can take a heavy gauge wire or whatever. You can hook this up to your negative terminal on the battery and then take the other end and touch it to a piece of metal on the bike let's say the engine cover or something like that anything metal not painted and if the bike lights up then you know you have a ground issue so the bike lit up and from there it was on the hunt to find out where the issue was so we traced all the wires from the ground down and eventually settled on this area right here which is the starter motor you can see right here this little thing right here and if you'll notice he did put a uh, starter motor cover some kind of bling from Kitico on that so we got to looking and up in this crevice there it was there was the culprit the ground cable that goes to the starter motor was not even hooked up at all so I don't even know how he had it running for it to quit running in the first place so the next step after that was to obviously turn the key on key everything worked all the lights went to working uh, we we did have the gas tank was just nasty uh, we pulled that off it had gas setting in it for several years and uh, we got that out cleaned it out and put it back on put some new fuel in it and the bike still wouldn't start so our first guess was probably it, I, I could tell I could not hear the fuel pump coming on so obvious guess was fuel pump so we took the fuel pump out the fuel pump had had some uh corroded wires and stuff that just didn't really have great connections i tried to uh put some new wire ends on them and get this thing going and we did not uh we was not able to do that but uh so in order to test to see if my theory was true if it was indeed the fuel pump i pulled the tank off the 2023 monkey we put the tank on this one and here you go so uh we're gonna test the bike out with the tank well, all right we do see that we still get power one of the things that i noticed with the old tank was that the fuel gauge was blinking back and forth back and forth now it's not doing that and so when we go to start it bam all right sweet sound of success we now have a running motorcycle so I've ordered the uh, replacement fuel pump. Hopefully that'll be in from Honda in 34 days and we'll get the bike put back together. In the meantime, you know what to do folks, keep it real. Feel free to uh, hit that like and subscribe button if you haven't already, man, that helps us kind of, uh, you know, do more stuff later down the road, bring you better content. At some point in time, I will do an install video on the Yoshimura RS3 exhaust that came with the bike. And uh, we'll uh, check back in as we kind of uh, clean this thing up, get it going, and all that other fun jazz. So, anyways, you know what to do, folks. Keep it real until the next time. Deuces. I am out.